Hello. Um, today I'm going to show you how to turn a CCI file into a proper working CIA. Now, I have no clue if this works with every game, but it looked like it works for this one. So I'm going to tell you how to do that because there's not really that many easy tutorials to find on turning a CCI into a CIA or even just turning into a 3DS file in that fact. Now, why would you want to turn a CCI into a CIA file? Uh, it's because CIA files are uh, cooler. CC, CCI may not need to be installed, but CIA, like, you can do a lot more stuff with, and that's why you would want to do it. And I'm mainly doing this uh, as a tutorial because my I have an old 2DS, you know, one of the $80 ones from Walmart. And, you know, I do not own a new Nintendo 3DS, and it would not let me do anything with this file because it was encrypted and I couldn't decrypt it. So I'm going to show you how to turn an encrypted CIA or CCI into a decrypted CIA. So first you want to get this tool, Batch CIA 3DS Decryptor, and just run this through the decryptor. Now, if you have an encrypted CIA file, nine times out of ten you're getting a CCI file. That 1% is probably because it isn't decrypted. Anyway, so you have the CCI. Now, of course, you can still load this, but people want the CIA so they can install it. So, to turn this into a, a viable 3DS or CIA file, you don't need any special tools or anything. You literally just right click it rename change cci to 3ds it's actually that fucking simple and i'm not joking when i say it's that simple it, it will give you this warning but the truth is cci and 3ds are the exact same file so really nothing's happening when you're doing this it's like it's like turning a mp4 into an avi file except that doesn't work I don't, I don't know a good example of doing something like that, but still. Anyway, now you want to put the 3DS into your God Mode 9 and put it into in. Yes, you do have to own an actual 3DS to do this, because you, you still need to turn this 3DS file into a CIA file. And you also have to have the Mega Script and everything else. So if you don't have any of those, go hack your 3DS real quick. It's very simple and easy. Anyway. Um, so you take your 3DS file, your decrypted 3DS file, and you put it into the in file that's in God Mode 9. And now, we're going to do a little bit of editing magic, and we're going to switch straight over to my phone recording my 3DS screen, because I refuse to get a 3DS capture card, because I do not feel like spending $1,000 on a 3DS capture card. Hello, welcome to the 3DS screen. Now, after you've put your 3DS file into God Mode 9, you want to take your SD card out and put it in your 3DS. What'd you expect? Now, <clears throat> to open go to open to open God Mode Nine, God Mode Nine, you press Start and press the Power button. Now, when you're in God Mode Nine, just click now. That don't matter. And uh, click the now click the Home button so you can pull up the Home menu, and go down to Scripts. Click A and God Mode Nine Mega Script. Once you're at this screen, let's see if I can make it focus a little bit more. There you go. Once you're on this screen, <clears throat> you're gonna go down to miscellaneous, click A, and then click 3DS to CIA converter, and you should see your 3DS game right there. If it's a CCI, I'm pretty sure it will not recognize it. So just click A, and pray you have enough storage space for it, and click yes. As you can see, it has successfully done it. If it has not successfully done it, you might either A, be out of storage space, or B, it may not be compatible. Again, I'm not 100% sure this is the only game I'm doing this with. Now, you can just press the power button and just power off the system. As we are going to be putting this back into our computer. Once you are back on your uh, desktop, uh, go, back to the, go back to the God Mode 9 folder and go to Out. That's where you're new CIA file should be. Now, you can do whatever you want with this file. You can install it in Citra. If you want to play this game, if you don't have a capture card, you can play it on here if you want to. Or, you know, if it's a new 3DS game, you can do it on here. 
Or you could, I don't know, mess around with the files. That's what I'm actually going to do with this copy. Um, I'm going to uh, use one of my mod tools on it. If I can find it. No, it's game specific. Nintendo line. Now you can, you know, say use this tool with it. The hacking toolkit for 3DS. You know, you can do the thing. Make sure. And watch it extract because it's unencrypted. So now I have all the files to this game. So yeah, that's pretty much that's pretty much how you turn a CCI file into a CIA. If you want to.